The intensity of the fire was clear from how little it left behind. When it began, the tent which had occupied this scorched space was packed with women and children celebrating a wedding. Fire officials say the temperature inside would have reached 1500 Celsius within just two minutes. They say the tent was made of highly flammable material and failed to comply with other safety regulations. The tent had only one exit, which caused a stampede when the fire broke out, leading to the fall of more victims. These tents lack the necessary authorized safety equipment. Tents that we authorize are equipped with multiple fire exits. We will investigate along with other authorities what caused the incident. Kuwait's interior ministry said rescuers had difficulty evacuating the injured because the scene, a densely populated residential area was flooded with onlookers and relatives. This catastrophe is one of the worst to take place in Kuwait. My prayers go out to the people of Kuwait and the families of the victims. The interior minister should inform us about the cause of this accident. Whatever caused this, we will not remain silent. We will hold the minister, any minister, accountable for this. The scale of this tragedy, which officials say is the worst such incident in four decades, has brought both grief and recrimination. The immediate focus, though, is on trying to save the lives of the many critically injured victims now in hospital. Harry Fawcett, Al Jazeera.